We're live! Hello and welcome to another episode of the Face Break Show. My name is Jeff Ramsey. With me, as always, uh, Emily Lath and uh, <laughs> Eric, my friend. <laughs> and uh, we're going to do a bunch of fun shit today. Stuff. I'm sorry. I'm not supposed to swear in the first five minutes or something. I don't know who you're apologizing to. You already said it. But That's a good point. Chit, 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 chit. Well, not going to help us. Triple shits. Okay. Uh, so today we're going to do uh, what we always do. We're going to talk about some of the stuff that came out last week and what it graded out at. I want to do a little show and tell for some stuff that I got over the weekend. We'll open a little bit of mail. We'll open up Emily's Disney cutie cuffs, see if we can get her. Uh, who is it you were looking for again? Marie. Marie, yeah. Yeah. And, Dumbo. Then, and then we're going to do something special today. What? Yeah, I uh, special? in honor of Topps Baseball 2024 Series 1 coming out, uh -huh. which is like the big baseball product, I have gone and I have purchased, you want to cut to my screen, every single kind of box Holy or pack shit. you can buy of Topps 2024. Mm -hmm. This is, if you... <laughs> I, as far as I'm aware, there's no other way to buy the cards. That's pretty awesome. Now that you've uh, messed them all up, why don't you go ahead and tell me what they're all called? Oh, I can easily do that. Thank Great. you very much. Uh-huh. Uh, this is what's called a fat pack. Mm -hmm. Okay? Or a cello pack. Got it. Uh, retail product. This is what's called a hanger. Retail product. As they say, hangers are bangers. This is what's called a retail <laughs> box. It's designed to be opened up and sold individual packs. Is there a rhyme for that? I don't know. All right, just making sure. This is what's called a uh, Hobby Mega Box. Okay. This is the most expensive of the products. Mm -hmm. I don't remember how much I paid for this, but okay. it was probably three or 400 bucks. How many packs are in that? Uh, I don't know how many packs are in it, but it's going to have an doesn't, auto and two relics. Doesn't say it right on the side there? Uh, 40, 10 packs, 40 cards per pack. Cool. Then That's we have a just lot. a regular yeah. Hobby Box. This mm -hmm. would be the most common, uh, I think, collector box. Okay. Uh, you're going to have one autograph and one re or relic. Mm -hmm. Then uh, blasters, which is how this is retail. This is how most people probably buy cards right. these days. Blasters would be the most common way to buy a card. Then we have the monster box. This is a retail product. I've never seen it before. I don't know. Uh, I bought it online, but and supposedly. Wh what's in it? Just all the same shit. Uh, I, so th th this one has uh, Topps foil board, 1989 Topps foil board card. How many packs and how many cards? How many packs? Uh, 16 packs, 14 cards per pack. Got it. 224 total cards. Wow. And then this is what's called a mega box. This is also a retail box. Uh, this is about 60 bucks. This is 16 packs, 14 cards per box. And what's well. the name of this one one more time? This is the Jumbo Hobby. Got it. Hobby, okay. Jumbo Mega Hobby. You can Got see it. the difference a little bit better if you do it like this. Yeah. Uh, Just to see... So a lot of times, so this has like a, like 10 packs, but you're like, there's like a ton of cards per pack. Is that sort of like the Yeah, move? they're 40 cards per, per pack. That's crazy. So, so is that kind of like how these are? There's 36 cards This is that. 36. Wow. Yeah, so these are the expensive two right here that you can only get through hobby shops. Uh, and then all this other stuff is technically so, available at a store. So you bought store. everything that you could possibly buy from there's the Topps Baseball 2024? To my knowledge. I don't think Got there's it. any other kind of box or pack you can buy. Okay. To my knowledge. I might be wrong. So that's not to say we're going to get every card in the collection. It's that we, we're we trying our chances on a lot of this stuff. And now you can see the difference in what yeah. you could be buying. I thought this would be a, a kind of a fun thing where yeah. we can go through it together. I dig um, it. We're not going to open it all today, but maybe we'll get, you know, it'll take a couple weeks. We could try, but that's a lot of packs. But I would love to, when it's all said and done, say like, okay, we paid eight bucks for this hanger pack. This what is did how we much get money out of it? we got yeah, out of yeah, it. Yeah. You paid 350 bucks. This is how much we got out of it. You paid whatever in this, and determine ourselves mm -hmm. uh, to the best of our ability what is the best bang for your buck oh nice i like that i think that's right. really cool teaching yeah. people what what you can buy and uh, they, maybe you shouldn't spend 350 dollars on um this one has cards. holiday stuff look wow. for eggs rabbit flowers umbrella i've never seen that oh uh, i we, can yeah we've seen it i feel like we've seen it once we've seen it like once before and it was very weird so every year they have different parallels, yeah. or different inserts, different fun things to chase. And each one of these packs or boxes will probably have a different mm -hmm. chase. Will these yeah. have that thing that we learned about where the one of one Dude. base card? So they did this thing this mm -hmm. year with Tops, and I'm excited to go through it because of this, where I think it's a great idea. 
I'll put Fan- Fanatics is getting a lot of shit right now. Yeah. Fanatics owns tops. They've taken over. They're getting a lot of shit for showing uh, baseball players wieners. Hey, I'm, I'm, for, I'm all for it. <laughs> I know Emily's all in. Those jerseys look uh, fucking terrible. They are. It's man. just nipples and They're wieners so all day long. <laughs> uh, but they, they've been attempting to do some cool stuff in uh, collectibles. This one kind of went awry. They had this idea where they were going to mark <laughs> the first card of every, like the first card First individual card of each. Oh uh, wow! Set. So like, oh I kind, oh I kind of did the that. The very first Ronald yeah. Acuna. Yeah, 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 yeah. They'd make it a one of one, I and they were it. gonna put this big thing on it that says uh, first print. Yeah. Right. And there's nothing different about the card. It's not laminated. It's, just, in it's any the first way. one. And they made those, but they forgot to put the first print symbol on the front. So people are just getting base cards that say one of one on the back, and they don't know what to do with them. Uh, because they completely dropped the ball on it. So, and most people don't think to look at the back of their regular ass base cards. So there's probably hundreds out there. Well, there, there, there can only be a couple hundred, right? Because there's only 400 cards in the set or whatever. But there's uh, most of them will probably never be seen. When it's nobody, when it's everybody's job, it's nobody's job. Mm-hmm. When somebody goes, dude, isn't this a cool idea? And then no one's in charge of it. You get one of one on the back of some Ronald <laughs> Jr. cards yeah. that are just base. So then you, Ooh. once you open it, then you flip it over and just check to I see. I have to do an extra check on the back. That sure. sucks. Yeah, it's kind of annoying. Um, um, but what did we get last time and then all this other stuff that we have that we're, before we get to that? You know, I was going to say, we have this old Topps uh, magazine that somebody sent in to us from 1992. Uh-huh. I, I loved Mark, I think we all loved Mark McGuire back then. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I never opened it up yet. And then I just opened it up today and realized there's cards in it. Oh, what? Speaking of that, look at that. There's my oh, Larry Bird cool. rookie that oh, yeah? I graded. Cool. Uh, we got a... Uh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. Uh, Mike Messina, Barry Larkin, Juan Gonzalez, Barry who we Larkin. have an auto baseball nice, yeah. love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. And then Dion, Neon Dion. Prime Neon time. Dion, he had so yeah. many nicknames. Yeah, yeah. prime time, baby. Uh, Roberto Alomar, Fred the Crime Dog McGriff, Doug Drabeck, <laughs> and George Brett. Cool. That's cool. Love you, Crime Dog. Boys of Summer, Books of Summer. All right, so let's set that aside. I thought that was awesome. Cool. Okay, what's next? Uh, what's next is last week we opened up, or, or two weeks ago. Yeah. We open up a bunch of stuff. Yeah. Uh, there wasn't really anything interesting to talk about, but I did think this one would be worth revisiting. Okay. If you remember, we opened up a blind video game box. Oh, that's right, yeah. NES box, and we got Mega Man. That wasn't graded, though. It's not graded or anything, no. but I looked it up. It sells for about 100 bucks. Mega Man? Yeah, 80 to $100 in wow. in this exact condition. Really? Without, with, if it had... Uh, if it was graded, if it had the, it was unopened, I, I, if it had the box, it'd be like multiple thousands. I, I have a friend who runs a, uh, all the social for a thing called uh, Cheap Ass Gamer. Mm-hmm. It's all like that that stuff from my friend Jared, and he does that. He collects games like in box, all, all, like, and he tells me about the difference in like this one has packaging, this one has the instruction booklet, this one doesn't have any of that stuff, and like the amount varies wildly. And mm-hmm. people collecting that stuff, dude, that is so fucking crazy. Yeah, that's wild. If you have I, look at your old physical media. Yeah. Just take a look at it. Physical media is taken off as a collectible, and it's only going to become more sought after, I think, as we get further and further away from the need for it. I have a, I think, a retail copy with instruction book and everything of Marvel vs. Capcom 2 for PlayStation 2, and that's apparently worth pretty good money. Huh? Fell apart. What happened? Uh, you got, which one's this? It's I'm, the monster. It's Suli. Suli. I've never seen <laughs> monsters. <laughs> really? Yeah. <gasps> Here you go. Oh, that's, that's for you. So but, I can but they work at a business. They're incorporated. I know. Yeah. Oh, that movie's good. We should watch it. Sure. Sully's a cool one. That's uh, John cute, Goodman, right? He's a cutie cuff. Yeah. Well, let's Actually, see if I'll we can... My... Gracie, Monsters, Inc. What? Love. Yeah. Oh, love. I thought you said no. And I'm like, whoa. <laughs> All right. Fingers crossed. Uh, we Dumbo and Marie. Dumbo and Marie. Dumbo and Marie. Oh. Ah. It's Rafiki. We got Rafiki. We're getting close to having your whole set, though. Yeah. Except for the one you want. I know. Well, maybe next week I can These get These are what you got me for us. Valentine's Day. That's true. Yeah? She held on to them to open them here. That's I, fun. I bought her more than... If you if you say so, I don't... I bought her other things, too. That's fine. Uh, okay, let's go through some mail. Let's what, see what we, we got. Don't, you're not going to show your other things? Oh, yeah, sorry. Uh, so in my personal life, I still open cards, right? I don't do it all on here. It's true, I've seen and, it. And uh, I got a couple of interesting things. First off, I wanted to show... We're not going to open them up this week. But uh, you remember last year when we had the Monopoly cards? Yeah. The Prism Monopoly mm-hmm. I was excited about? They came out again. Oh, okay. So I was able to get a couple of boxes mm. off of uh, Target.com. Mm-hmm. I opened two at home. I have three here for us. I opened two at home, and I got this uh, sweet Jason Tatum. Oh, nice. Uh, purple That's Wave cool. parallel. But I just wanted to show you. Like, they're pretty cool-looking cards yeah. this year. So we'll, we'll get into them. The Wimby rookie would be insane. 
Speaking of insane, monopoly. uh huh. I've been opening up some prison uh, MBA at my house. Okay. And I pulled this guy, which is a green prison Wimby. Oh, Jesus. This guy raw is going for Rod about eye. 200 to 250. Whoa. On eBay. Uh, wow. Which is pretty good. But pales in comparison to this motherfucker uh -huh. that I pulled, oh, wow. which is a silver prism Victor Wimanyama Raw, which is going for about nine hundred dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Every single sale has gone for between eight and nine hundred, and there have been a lot of sales. Jeez. So uh, I don't know that that'll maintain, but what we're gonna no. do is send this off tomorrow to get graded. Are you gonna get it graded? I'm gonna try to sell this card oh, because graded, cool. it's going for about three thousand dollars. So what, what a savvy collector will do in a situation like this yep. is they'll they'll if they get the card early they'll get it out the door yeah. during the hype. His card will tank at some point. Yeah, yeah, He'll yeah. have an injury or a goes. bad yeah. a bad season. It'll go back down. Maybe it's maybe the graded PSA ten is three thousand dollars now. Yeah. Maybe it goes down to twenty five hundred, twenty two hundred, and then you rebuy back buy it back later because this will maintain a tremendous amount of value. Yeah. If he stays healthy. For but, most the, of his career. but the point is to send it now yeah. to get it graded now. So yes. if you were going to sell it, you would sell it now. Yeah, I'll rush yeah. delivery, yeah, do yeah. the whole thing, Damn, get it out wow. the door fast. That's a, what a cool ass pull. That's a good one. That's man. an insane pull. Yeah. Wow. So almost imagine $1, if it was card. on the show. One of the I'm, nah. sorry. <laughs> That's okay. We have some mail to get. We to. have some mail to get to. I realized I forgot the pack sack again. I don't that's, know where he is. That's okay. Story of my life, huh? Yeah. Uh, Ooh, this uh. this letter is written to you on the back of a Red Baron box. Oh my God. Oh my God. Are you garbage awesome. if you send yeah, yeah, a letter no on a pizza box? Uh, uh, hello, that's a yes. Hello, Jeff, <laughs> Emily, look. Eric, and the Break Show crew. Also, Andrew and Gavin. Eh. Nah. I've been watching RT for so long, but fuckface has reignited my love for you guys. The Break Show is a beacon of joy each week, and I love all the wacky cards you open. Here's a bunch of random packs I found at a store in Halloween Town. Ooh. Maybe they're haunted. Anyways, what? best of luck yeah. and congratulations Keep on turning. getting Keep married, going. Jealous yep. you and I, yeah. and not dying. Hey. Eric, congratulations. Come on. Sincerely, <laughs> Daniel from Oregon. Come on, it was one curse. It was one, <laughs> one simple curse. They got a little green army man, which mm -hmm. is awesome. So you got some cool cards. There, there are got. a few in here. I think feed most of them to the pack sack. I think that one's Nightmare cool. Nightmare for Christmas. Dino cards. Yeah. Open I think this next one is one that you'll probably want to open. Make a band Yeah, that feels like one you want to open. Uh, antique cars of Panini. Oh, yeah. Clips. San Diego Zoo. Mm -hmm. that's, yeah, that's, that's a cool friend. one. Not a gas car. Independence Day. I didn't even know they had cards. Mm -hmm. And uh, MM2 cards? That's Marilyn Monroe. Wait, no. What's that, what's MM that name? Marilyn Monroe. Right. Oh, yeah, Marilyn Monroe cards. Neat. So, well, we'll feed the pack sack with some of them. What do you want to open? Let's open up these two. American yeah. Bandstand and Dinosaurs right now, and then we'll uh, we'll throw those in the pack sack. This is a different pack sack, but I think it's trash. Yeah, it's a trash sack. What? Yeah. Uh, okay, what do we got? We got, uh, ooh, Hong Kong show. <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> uh, oh, I'm going to hold off on that one because Emily loves it. Ooh, turtles. that's cool. Here's guess. Brian Highland. I don't know who Brian Highland is, do y'all? What are you saying? Mike. <laughs> uh, he recorded 22 charts. I guess it's just a solo dude. Oh, he wrote Itsy Bitsy Teeny Weeny Yellow Polka Dot ah, Bikini, or at least he recorded it. Teeny yeah. Weeny. I mean, that's Mike's like screaming it in there. Yeah, so. He is. Yeah. Uh, Mary Wells. Ooh, Johnny Rivers. Mm. The Sign Off Salute. Bill Doggett. The okay. <laughs> Special offer. Nice. Nice. Classic Series 1. We got a bunch of those. And then Emily's favorite band. Uh-huh. Sex Symbol. Yeah. Oh. We'll see why in a second. Okay. Loves them to death. Let's see. Mick Fleetwood. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Let's look at that card again. Let's look. There you Yay. go. That's a sup if I've ever seen one. He looks like the guy from... Fleetwood Mac? <laughs> <laughs> Man, he looks like a really talented. He looks musician. like he looks like the butler from Rocky Horror Picture Show. Yes, yes, he does. Time is fleeting. Yeah. That's a great call. Yeah. Will you open this one for me? Dino cards. Oh, you want to open the Marilyn Monroe? Yeah, yeah. And I'll put it after too, the dino cards. This says it might have gold in it. <laughs> oh, okay. oh, she didn't even she didn't even care about the dinosaurs, and we want She didn't even care about the Comptosaurus. Blah, blah, blah. He's from the late Jurassic. He's 145 million years out. old. Dude, he doesn't look up day Remember? over 135 million. We saw that TikTok of the dinosaurs running. Like, oh, which yeah. Which ones are faster? That was cool. That's crazy. Some of them dinosaurs are fast. Yeah. Doesn't it look like he has hands? Iguanodon. It does you look think, like yeah. he has hands. Yeah, well, he's but got they're like little tongue. mittens. Yeah. 
Uh, Leptoceratops. Wow. We got Lesothosaurus. Mm -hmm. That's you. Uh, <laughs> Eerie, that's, that's Emily. That's that's Emily. <laughs> uh, Saltosaurus. That's me. That, <laughs> Sauropelta. That's, that's a cool, that's a cool one. <laughs> Megalosaurus. Oh wow, that's he's my... whoa! Look <laughs> at him. Uh, Euplocephalus. Wow. That's Eric and that's, uh, Gavin. That's really, yeah, definitely. That's how we hang out. <laughs> yeah. And then. Chasmosaurus, Chasmosaurus. Yeah, that's a uh, Andrew. You you have to He's think about great. how far apart all these dinosaurs were in like time too, mm -hmm. where it's like 145 million. Oh, only 120 million, and it's like there's 25 million years. Yeah, they that. didn't know each other. No, no, not no. not at all. A lot of these dudes weren't friends yeah. or enemies. Yeah. Do girls have favorite dinosaurs? Uh, I usually I would say that my main one would be the Triceratops. It's pretty tight, but I love a good like long neck. Now, okay, so so yeah, so the answer for her is she likes uh, Land Before Time. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Pretty answer, much anybody in Land Before Time. Yeah. The correct answer is Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus Thank is you. the best dinosaur. He was so cute in Land Before Time, though. Okay. <laughs> Let's see what's up with Marilyn Monroe. What's she up to? Uh, there she is in a bathing suit. Young. At the beach. That looks like gold. Oh, that looks like that looks like a painting. In the background. Oh no, that's uh, I bet that's Acapulco. Ooh. Uh, here she is at the at the pyramids. Ah. Uh, oh, here's a great picture of her at the <laughs> Eiffel Harry. Tower. Uh, and she's smiling. At, she's probably at a Aww, restaurant. Oh, kitty. Uh, oh goodness, she forgot her shirt. Oh. oh. Um, oh, here Can we she show is. that on RoosterTeeth.com, RoosterTeeth.com app? Here she is on a win at a windmill. Oh. That's, that looks uh, like uh, Amsterdam, huh? She, yeah, that does. That's Holland. probably Amsterdam, Holland. Here mm -hmm. she is uh, with a parasol. Oh, cutie. Uh, oh, here's business Monroe. Busy looks like she's at the steps woman. of a court. Yeah. Oh, she's probably just. Uh, yeah, she's doing law. Yeah. Oh, and then we got this uh, <gasps> sort of a silver oh. prism. Ooh. That's cool. Nice. Marilyn Monroe silver wave prism auto on card. What is it on the back? She's doing the get my mama darling. <laughs> Hello, my ragtime gal. <laughs> she's being Michigan J. Thank Frog. you. Yeah, she's Michigan J. Frog. <laughs> uh, okay, we'll put these away. Then we'll open up this box. This mail is very interesting, and I wanted you to open it second. Hello, Jeff. Thanks for everything you guys do. Thank you for watching and listening. I've been a fan since the early days of AH. Yeah, that, that one's dead. But only recently Barry. discovered uh, Face. Great. And haven't been able to stop listening since. Thank you so much. That's great. Uh, this led me to the break show and sparked an interest in collecting and opening cards. After all you've given to us, I figured I would give something for you to return. Here are a few Marcus Smart cards I collected. <gasps> Ooh. Hope you don't find any of these in your collection already. Re regulation listener, Brandon. Oh, Brandon. Check it out. Marcus Smart. There's a reason I wanted you to check these out. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Oh, well, you got it. I'm you right there, bud? You're getting I'm it. Are you shaking? I'm gonna Falling apart? Whoa. Oh, uh, dang. Oh, shit. Yeah, I don't have this. So this is PSA graded. Wow. As well. like, this is a PSA 9 2022 yep. Crown Royal. Uh huh. You wanna... Crystal gold. This is numbered to 10. Yep, you want to set it down flat so that way the this camera can see it. This is number 4 of 10. There you go. Dang. Yeah. Holy shit. That's yeah. a huge hit. Yeah. <gasps> These Brandon. are. So Brandon, I don't know Brandon's collection. But it's pretty fucking wild. Oh, um, oh my god! Uh, we gotta send Brandon a care package. Oh <laughs> a my very god. expensive care package. Brandon sent me. This is a immaculate uh, Marcus Smart. Uh huh. Uh, one of three yeah. auto. It's a patch auto. Wow. So uh, that. Uh, don't <laughs> know, oh my don't god! Know, uh, what to say about that? That is instantly one of the best Marcus Smart cards I have. Uh huh. But I've got some more ones. Uh, Do you think it's the S on the Celtics? Because it goes back yeah, up? It might be. <gasps> uh, uh, I think it's the C, but it's upside down and backwards. You think so? Uh, this is 2022, -uh. 2023, so this is last year's Immaculate. <laughs> yeah, they put it in backwards. No. I mean, yeah, yeah it's all messed up. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> oh my god. I'm all overwhelmed. Yeah, I thought that might happen. Oh, fuck. Here's so the... check this out. All right, well. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Brandon's crazy. Brandon's gonna make me cry on the, <laughs> on the TV. Wow. Uh, this is uh, this is Panini Lux. This is a patch rookie card, uh, uh -huh. numbered to twenty-five. Wow. This is instantly among the rarest rookie cards I have, and I have a lot. I have thousands. Um, not thousands of rookie cards. I have hundreds, but thousands of. Dang. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Brandon. Brandon's really, uh... uh... Let's see what the fucking... 
Oh, oh hell. my god. Uh -huh. And then another <gasps> so this is a this is a this is a two patch RPA. Uh -huh. uh, oh my gosh. So this is um it's a rookie uh what is it, rookie rampage, I think. Yeah, it's a Panini Excalibur. It's uh it's one of their higher I don't know if they still make them, but it was one of their higher end uh Panini uh, sets in the in that era, 2015, 2016. Uh, as you can see here, we have, uh, it's numbered 194 of 349. This is a rookie. Um, this is a sticker auto. And then the patch here, we have a uh, part of his jersey clearly, and then we have a uh, part of a basketball. Yes. Wow. Yeah. And that uh, absolute part of a. Yep. Congratulations. Uh, yep. That was a really nice gift. Uh, thank you, Brandon. <laughs> like maybe one of the nicer things yeah. a person I've to my knowledge, never met has ever done for me. Yeah. Wow. Uh, Brandon, if you can just contact me on uh, Twitter Brandon, or Instagram or something, we'll uh, we'll figure it out. I would love to repay you in some way. Yeah. Brandon. That uh, those day. cards are out. I opened that right before we got here, and I just went, I don't know anything about these, and I went, oh fuck. Yeah. Hey. These are, um, the PSA graded nine was the one you started with. That's yeah, wow. a nice card, man. And they got crazier. Yeah, I was afraid I would, by going from the back. I was because yep. I thought it was I could feel that that one was graded. I thought yep. maybe I was wow. going the wrong way with it. Yep. but I wasn't. They were all phenomenal. Each one was better than the last. Wow. Uh, I, I'm I'm really I'm really uh, thank you. So <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I'm fucking lost for words here. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that. Um, it's pretty so incredible. Cool. Yeah. And Brandon, you are there's nothing regulation about you, man. Thank you. Yep. So much. I mean that's really something. Mm -hmm. Wow. And put the army man on top to guard him. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> oh, those are going home immediately and never coming back to this building. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wow, man, that's really crazy. That's like the coolest. Well, thing. that was a great show, guys. Yeah, exactly. uh, <laughs> So this will be fucking done. Let's uh, let's open some packs. Yeah, you get all some right. Baseball. Let's do some baseball. Okay, uh, now I think we have to try to keep everything here I'm gonna, separate. I'm gonna try that. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Emily, we might have to throw them in the um, Doritos bag. The binder that you have. Okay. Yeah. Does that make sense to you? Yeah. <laughs> Let's uh, we keep these safe in this Dorito bag. So the Chase Cool Ranch. The big cards you want out of this year's tops are obviously always going to be rookies. Jason Dominguez. Yeah. Uh, D Dustin Henry, is that his name? Uh, and then uh, uh, Ellie De La Cruz. Although I thought he had a rookie card last year too, but his, his rookie card's really sought after right now. So uh, those are what we're looking for. We're also looking for hometown heroes. That's uh, and a bunch of other different parallels. Okay. Um, they have these things called gold backs. They have uh, photo variations, as always. Let's see what we got. John Gray, okay. uh, Daniel Palencia, rookie. Ah, ah. Uh, Seawald, uh, Jesus Lazardo. You think it's Jesus? You think that's how you pronounce it? <laughs> Jesus Lazardo. Jesus. Uh, George Boo! <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you like Martinez, him? He was, he was one of the cheating Astros on the cheating Astros. Felix Batista, Daily Ober, Starling Marta. Uh, Marta. Don't matter. It's fine. Keep going. Keep rocking and rolling. Mm -hmm. uh, this is J Rod, American League Leaders. Oh, that's with, cool. Uh, Adolis Garcia and Kyle Tucker. Uh, Angels. Adley, <laughs> Adley Year Two. Uh, <laughs> the Angels are so bad. It's great. Andrew Monasterio. That looks like it could be. A, yeah, it might be something. It's not. Okay. Look at the poor angels. Where it's would not. it be on the card? Because I can go through and oh, double check uh, the back. Well, for the one of one, it would be like right here, I believe. Okay. okay. Um, but I was looking at the serial number to see if it was a photo variation, but it's not. Mm -hmm. uh, if it ends in two, I believe it's not. Uh, Kiebert Ruiz, uh, Alika Williams. I think it's Kyber Ruiz, but it's okay. Is I'm it? not, trying, need, to I, that's I need I'm not trying to correct you. I'm Kybert just trying to. Kyber Ruiz. Ky good. Kyber Ruiz is, yeah. I that's took fine. most You're, of last year off of you. I totally understand. Jordan Westberg. Mm hmm. Uh, he dirty. Eduardo Rodriguez. He's uh, dirty. Mikel Garcia. He had stuff all over. Oh. Tyler Soderstrom. Daniel Bard. I like the Rockies ones. Yeah, By the way, these their are... city connects are like nice. Doesn't have anything to do with. I mean, it's a Colorado mountain, but these are uh, highly controversial. The new design. A lot of people yeah. fucking hate them. Okay, let's see. Uh, this. I mean, this is this. It's a departure oh, from what they've looked Trent like for the last Trent Grisham, years. former Padre, now New York Yankee. Trent Ooh. Grisham in our City Connects, too. Uh, here we have a you, Jose Fermin mm -hmm. rookie, uh, like a orange or brown parallel. Oh, yeah, it's numbered to. So every year, this is another cool thing that Tops does. They have a, this color parallel, yeah. right? And then they have it uh, as many, they print as many as the year. So this year, they're, this is 1280 out of 2024. So okay. next year, this parallel oh, will fun. be out of 2025. Yeah. So if you could go ahead okay. and sleeve that. 
Uh, we got a backwards card, which means it's a, oh, shit. What'd you get? Hell yeah. Andrew Vaughn. Fuck yeah, dude. I haven't seen one of these yet. Uh, is it Andrew Vaughn, but it's a uh, team parallel. Yeah, so you that's, can see the White Sox oh, in the background. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, I, I was, like that a lot. I was thinking for this year, I might try to get all the White Sox and all the Tigers that's team cool, parallel. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, the, cards, that's awesome. The gradient at the top of that is weird, but I mean, I guess that's how all the cards are. They have like yeah. that. Sort of gradient at the top, but it's interesting. There's a blue parallel for the Korea shower. Oh, that's there a cool picture. Uh, oh, cool. These are fun cards. I don't know how much they're worth. Uh, this one's probably worth a little bit. Uh, this is a Derek Jeter. Oh, wow. Uh, these are called, uh, fuck, I can't remember what they're called. Blueprint. Blueprints, yeah. Uh, I believe you're right there. <laughs> oh, that's, I mean, <laughs> I just guessed. Uh, anyway, those are cool. And I think they're, they're not case hits, but they're... His, so you get like one of box. He's got a whole thing in MLB The Show this year where like you play through his career or whatever. And I don't like him enough to do that. But oh, I'm really? Still, yeah, but I'm still going to play it. Billy Mays. Uh, this is the Ooh, that's a cool 89 card. I like that. Uh, anniversary. The stamp's cool in the top right. Mm -hmm. It's just neat. That's the 35th anniversary stamp. So I like that. Typical, so I think you can get the whole, there's a whole bunch of these you can mm. get. They're really nice. Uh, we got a Shohei, Stars of the MLB. Ooh. These Stars of the MLB, they have these parallels every year, and they're dog shit. Yeah. This year, they actually don't look too bad. No, it's okay. So uh, we got that. Got Bobby Witt Jr. I'm going to sleep about those. Uh, Royce Lewis, Luke Bailey. Mm -hmm. You want to put them right Luke in the middle Raleigh. of that yeah, right square. Uh, Astros. Boo. Jorge Mateo, Byron Buxton, J.D. Davis, Evan Carter, rookie, and Michael Harris. So we'll set these aside and say that those are the hanger cards. That's actually a pretty solid box. Do you hate the back. Dodgers more than the Astros? I hate the Dodgers more than anything. Oh. I think that is, in my life, probably the number one most hated thing. The Dodgers? Dodgers. Yes. Yeah. I hate them so much. For a long time, the Raiders. Like, Dodgers, you could eliminate... He's back, and he's madder than ever. Who? You could have, I'm getting there. Oh. You can eliminate the Dodgers from uh -huh. existence uh -huh. or Hitler. I mean, I think I would eliminate Hitler. Okay, you don't hate the Dodgers that much. I hate, oh. <laughs> I hate the Dodgers for, for how they, for baseball. Hitler, I think, is a different. Whole different animal. It's a whole different animal. <laughs> uh, that's, that's great, though. That's Let us know to... in the chat. Would you eliminate the Los Angeles Dodgers or Adolf Hitler? Leave a comment below and it's, smash uh, that subscribe button. Fuckfacepod.com slash first. Now we know that he doesn't, that there are things he hates more yeah. than the Dodgers. Uh, uh, Nick Senzel, Mike Yastrzemski, okay. Owen White, Raphael Devers, Logan Webb, uh, Johan, uh, Johan Rojas. There you go. Uh, Jake Rogers, Taylor Rogers, the Rogers twins. Uh, no, uh, Taylor Rogers is brothers with a different Rogers that plays baseball. Really? Yeah. That's crazy. Oh. Quinn Priester. What? <laughs> What's the most common last name in baseball? Probably Rogers. <laughs> do you think <laughs> Do you think two priests have ever been in a fight about who was a better priest? And one was like, I'm more priester I'm than priester you. I'm priester than you? Yeah. Uh, Alex Bregman. No, you love your Astros. Uh, Corbin Carroll stars the MLB. I'm going to sleeve that. And then uh, Marco Luciano. So this is the blaster box. We're just going to yeah. blast through them. None of blast these were first print. Okay, thank I you. I checked. Sad. Thank you for checking. Cry. Uh, oh shit, here's another one. Okay. Great. Uh, Jordan uh, Blazovic rookie, mm -hmm. and this is the Easter egg parallel. Oh, oh that's On fun. a rookie card. I, that looks like that's an what acorn. you were talking about. It does look like an acorn. I think it's an Easter egg. Um, I think you're right. That's yeah. fucking cool. So that's neat. Uh, Royce Lewis, Astros, Luke Riley, Jorge Mateo. Oh, Jake. he's flying! There he is. Matt! Jake. <laughs> he's trying. It looks like he's. It looks like he's hanging onto the Orioles. It looks like he's taking <laughs> off like Superman, that. or he's pushing it up. Here, like exactly. <laughs> uh, JP Crawford, Luke and Baker, Patrick, plenty of wisdom. Mm. Paul Goldschmidt. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, here we go. There's a insert series of the King Griffey Jr.'s career, That's Celebration neat. of the Kids. So here he is mm -hmm. as a Mariner. Uh, Emmett Sheehan, '89 Throwback Rookie. Mookie Betts, stars of the MLB. Boom! And then Matt Manning, so we'll set this aside. Man, that, uh, that Easter egg parallel was really cool, man. Uh, Rodrigo in the chat is saying it's a little concerning how much of the chat is on the fence about Hitler. Yikes. <laughs> Byron Buxton. It's on you guys. Davis, Evan Carter, Michael Harris, uh, Gleyber Torres. Torres. Mm -hmm. uh, here's a Desert Dance-Off. We got a oh. Coco Montez rookie, Kyle Bradish. Huh. Then, uh, oh, here we go. Here's a... Jose Rodriguez. J Rod? Uh, different <laughs> different J Rod. Jose Rodriguez, White Sox rookie. This is a some sort of a teal or like light blue parallel. And this is numbered to 50. 
So oh, that wow. is a huge fucking nice. Part. Hey. Uh, then we have this Walker Bueller appears to be a foil card, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Yeah. So that's cool. And we hate him. Uh, we hate him. Oh, because yeah. he's a Dodger. Pete yeah. Crow Armstrong rookie. I never wow. heard of him. And then Ryan Jeffers. Okay. Making our way through. About halfway through the episode. Making our way through. Yeah. This is going to take me a lot of work to figure out what they're all worth. But oh, shit. Here we I go. Again. Let's see. Brendan Rogers. This is a. I don't know what this parallel is. Do you guys get it? Would it be a egg, rabbit, flower, umbrella, watering can, or chicks? I think it's a flower. I think it's a flower. I think it's a flower. Can't do, Gracie, what's that look like? The background? Flower? Is feathers one of them? I think flower. Okay. But yeah. Uh, Leo de Tavoris, uh, Dane Myers, Ryan Mountcastle is saying he's touching the O. Up you. That's, that's, good. that's funny too. It's like he's fingering uh, it, it's fine. Uh, Freddie Peralta, mm -hmm. Craig, oh, Gavin, Gavin Biggio. There you Sorry, go. his kid. Yeah. Yes. Uh, Zach Remillard. Do you remember, uh, do you remember, I am Dr. Remulak. I am Dr. Remulak. Old Howard Stern. The guy that would call up and he would just say it over and over again. Howard oh, Stern. yeah. Yeah, I yeah. am Dr. Remillak. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Joe Ryan, Danny Jansen, it's the Dodgers. Hey. Boom. Ooh. Uh, we got a Corbin Carroll blueprint. Oh. That's nice. Jazz Chisholm. Great and baseball name, Jazz Chisholm Jr. Andrew Abbott Rookie Cup. We're going to sleep that too. Uh, another thing to look for in these is they have these pretty rare parallels uh, that are on, called vintage. They're on vintage cardstock, and the only way to tell is that the Topps logo is the old timey Topps logo. Oh, so really? You look through those. You really gotta fucking study Topps cards this year. I don't think I want to do that. Oh, they don't want you to. They're making trying to get you to slow down. Reed Detmer, Brad Keller. They taste the taste tops. the top. Harold Ramirez, uh, Grant Hartwig. As we go through these guys, Sam just Suzuki. look at the Topps logo in the top left. Let Anthony us know. Anthony Rizzo. Yeah, let us know if I miss it because I probably will. Yep. Bryce Elder, uh, Joey Weimer, Rayner, uh, Mackenzie Gore. What's uh, the old logo look like? It's like a, it's like a T. Oh, and it goes it's like loopy? that, and then it's like ops. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we got the Matt Manning blue parallel. Sleeve that. Corey Seager, MLB is a star, I guess. All right, two more packs of blaster. This blaster has been really good. We've had a lot of luck. I know there's a big pile of stuff that you had me sleeve. I've opened a bunch of these at home, and I haven't got shit. So it's been nice. backwards card. Uh, here we got another. This uh, Padres rookie flower. Matt Waldron yeah, it's flower parallel. Flower. Uh, J Rod. Maurizio Dubon. Oh. That's funny. Photo. Brendan Donovan. Uh, Nick Robertson. There's three assholes. Uh, Atlanta Bray. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, I just don't want to read them. Jared Triolo. Geraldo <laughs> Perdomo. So we got a Jeff Bagwell throwback. Oh, nice. I think Jeff, Jeff Bagwell probably got had worms a few times, right? Oh, I think you're right. Uh, Riley Green. And then uh, Cole Ray Raggins. Was there another Bagwell in the in, uh, MLB? I think his kid, right? Uh, is this kid? I don't know. I'm just guessing. Kevin Bagwell. <laughs> sure, there's. Let me see that. If Stop. if he has a kid who plays, he's probably on the. Uh, Blue Those Jays. all have to stay together too. I know, but I'm just checking. Uh, Dansby Swanson, best great baseball, baseball name. name. God, yeah. I love it. Nestor Cortez, Nestor's a good name too. Yeah. Uh, some more dudes. Uh, Padres. Hey, all right, in the city connects. Yeah, go Padres. Alex Kirilov, uh, Patrick Corbin, Dave Schneider. How many Dave Schneiders do you think there've been mm. through history? Like in the world? Yeah. A lot. A lot. Probably right. A lot. Braxton Garrett, uh, Zach Geloff. Oh, cool. That'd be fun to That's talk almost about. your name. Uh, <laughs> that's true. Uh, stars of the MLB. Christian Encarnacion Strand. I don't know him yet. Uh, Christian Bethancourt. And then got one of these Home Run Challenge cards. I don't know if I've ever what? shown these to you guys before. What is this? So, oh, yeah, it's Topps, so fun. Tops does this little game every year uh -huh. where if you get one of these cards, it says pick a game for a shot to win. So this is Ronald Acuna Jr. Uh -huh. So you go on the back and you scratch this off and you enter in a code on the Tops website and you say, I think, and you can pick any game from the 162 oh. game season. Uh -huh. And you think, you say, Acuna is going to hit a homer in game 64. Yeah. And if he does, they will mail you a special numbered card that's like numbered to 200 or how, I think however many people got it right. Wow. I did this a bunch when I was buying a bunch of baseball the year that Judge hit oh, yeah. 60 whatever. Uh-huh. 
and I got three judge cards. Holy he hit. shit. I got these, shit. and I get three. I hit it right on three Aaron judges. Yeah. So I, have, I have three Damn. pretty pretty nice parallels. That's pretty but, wild, And you dude. took into consideration yeah. the field that they were playing at. I did. I yeah. do. I paid attention. Sleeve all these? Uh, no, no. They just go in there. Okay. Keep the home run challenge one. Sleeve that one just so I can I see it. Okay. Just so he can do the home run challenge. Yeah, yeah. I got I to gotta go back and do it. Okay. So now we're going to do hanger. Hangers are bangers. Everybody knows that. These Everyone considered, knows that. For retail, these are considered to be the best uh, in terms of getting your return. I've recently given up on my dumb idea to build a house out of all the card boxes, so I'm... But all the card boxes are now. still in our storage unit. Next time we go to storage, I'll get them. I'll throw them away. It's a fucking waste of an awesome idea, but I'm going to do it. That's Nolan all you Arenado, Gray Kessinger, Merrill Kelly, Luis Abreu's, uh, Leo de Tavares. It's not because you you didn't pressure me. I'm just I just have decided that I'm not going to do it. Dane Myers, Ryan Mountcastle. I just know me. At least touching that up. Again? William Contreras. Stop Kyle getting Finnegan. Ryan Mountcastle. You can't get enough. Prelander Baroa, Kinley Jansen, Framber Valdez, Tyler O'Neill. Which player do you not like? Not because they're problematic, like all the sexual assault. So things. which Dodger do I hate the most? Okay, sure. Um, Maybe Shohei. Yeah, I mean now probably yeah. We'll just throw at him. It'll be fine. George Springer, boo. Uh, I'm gonna let you guys talk. Isn't the whole point to throw at him? Yeah, hopefully. Ooh, that Joe it? Musgrove card is sick. That's cool. Look yeah, at him. Nice. You want it? Look yeah. at him. Uh, no, I'm not going to do anything okay. with it. I just think it's cool. Colton Kowser. Uh, I mean, it's probably... Um, I want to say Mookie Betts, but it's probably not Mookie Betts. Oh, he's so cute, though. Yeah. He is cute. Taylor Rogers, Quinn he was Priester. On the... You like Freddie Freeman, though, right? You're a big Freddie Freeman fan. Uh, Alex Bregman. I think the, do the Braves did him so dirty. That sucks. Soka Montez. Who's your favorite? God Padre. Radish. That's tough. Um, it's it's probably Manny Machado. It's He's just... I love watching Manny Machado play. Jamison and people and just Sean hate him. Silver. People fucking hate him. Corey Seager, yellow parallel. That is, man, I wish that the Rangers had a cool uh, City Connect. It's almost cool. It's just so plain. Man, we're killing all these Jose Rodriguez. <laughs> yellow parallel, sleeve that. Get them uh, all. Vlad Jr., 89 throwback. Uh, speaking of, uh, Freddie Freeman. Boo. Uh, Lou Bob. Not a leader. Uh, Sal Frelick, rookie. Uh, J Rod, stars of the MLB. Oh, here we go. Willie, uh, Willie Mays, Grand Games. That's a insert. cool card. That's cool. Those are cool cards. They always do some kind of cool old timey insert. Max Muncy, Jacob DeGrom, Alec Marsh, Joey Votto, Zach Wheeler. Max Muncy. Gabriel Moreno. You hate Max Muncy. Hate Max Muncy. Hey, watching, Bryant, watching him slump Hason was Kim, uh, great. Gordon Westbrook, he slumped hard. Hassan Kim rules great. Tyler Soderstrom. Uh, yeah, uh, watching him slump was uh, funny. Yeah, it's sleeve, sleeve soda stream. And then here, keep all those together. Soda yeah. stream. Do you have the box? Yeah. That's how I've been keeping it tight. It's, it's a good, that's that's good, good thinking. It's a good system. Thank you. It's a great system, Emily. Thank you. Uh, okay. So what if we... What's like something cool? We're going to get something like cool. Yeah. This is kind Let's of open like... this monster box. Uh, you, know? you know what's cool? Monster box. I do. I like... Monster Mash, Monster Box, Monster Munch. So in this one, we're looking for 89 yep. Tops baseball foil board cards. Mm -hmm. Okay. Foil board. What does a foil foil board look like? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's white. I don't know why you said Not in front of Gracie. I don't know. I just don't know what it looks like. I just got no idea. Have you uh, plugged uh, Clutch My Pearls yet or no? No, but okay. I'd love it if people listen to Clutch My Pearls. Everywhere. You want to look right into your camera and at Clutch My Pearls Pod everywhere on the internet. Come follow us. Send us an email at clutchmypearlspod at gmail.com. If you like smut, if you don't like smut, if you know someone that does like smut, if you know someone, if you know someone who's always reading on their Kindle, they like smut. They're they're reading smut. Or I've noticed that at Target when we've been buying these cards, all the books that are like suggested at the yeah. like counter. That's all smut. Yes. Everything I'm like, there's a lot of like hardcore uh -huh. fucking in these books. Yep. And they're like, hey, wanna, you know, impulse buy this? So, you know, yep. check it out. Yeah, there you go. Check what? it out. Foil card? No, I was just saying, there you go. Check out Clutch My Pearls. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, or else. Like, subscribe, share, listen, yeah. help. Help, please. Listen, beat off, do whatever you need to there's do. There's a video version if you want to check out the video version. That, yes. And it's on YouTube? It is on YouTube, and it's <laughs> Clutch My Pearls Pod everywhere. Sorry, I'm checking. I'm, I'm doing this. Uh, Stars <laughs> MLB, Ellie De La Cruz, rookie. That's good. Oh, yeah, oh, now, cool. you, that's can watch, now you can Davis watch our reactions. He's one of the big rookies to grab. Mm -hmm. uh, base, Justin Steele, Paul Goldschmidt. 
No, it's a, it's a delightful podcast, the Clutch by Pearls podcast. Yeah, now you can see all of our expressions and eye rolls, and yeah. I've started doing a really fun thing where when I'm reading the really nasty parts, I'm making eye contact. Yeah, you're just like staring right at Vanessa. Yeah. I stare at Vanessa and your wife, yeah. and then it's like, who's going to get it? This guy's name is Trey Cat. That's a food man if I've ever That's seen a it. food man. We'll have to... Look for it in the future. Yep. We have to keep all these together for right yep. now. Uh, Cutter Crawford, that's a good name for baseball. Oh, Kodai Singa, that's a good card. Uh, here's the Red Sox, Alex Verdugo. Yeah, if you like, uh, did you know that vampires have dog dicks? Oh my I gosh. didn't either. No, I no, I think it's werewolves. Podcast. Oh, werewolves and have then dog dicks. And then apparently we were Ashton educated Garrett. greatly exactly. like, oh, by oh, everyone oh. who was like, actually, that's not fully the Omegaverse. Did you get into the Omegaverse? But we're yeah. just dipping our toes in. All right. Well, this box, this pack just fucking. Did we just go off? Yeah. Did you just get a dog dick? Right there. We got the okay. NL League leaders. There's the Rays. Here's Hunter Green. Let's do it this way. Here's Ronald Acuna Jr. stars the MLB. Nice. Uh, here's the one of those home run shots. Oh, really? Who is this it? This one's Ozzy Albies. Uh, uh, yeah. This is an Aaron me. Judge uh, nine throwback. Wow. Some sort of a... Uh, I like the name a, Ozzy might be the Albies. Foil board. Yeah, this is a good one. It feels Albies good. a cute name. Feels good. This Thank might you. actually be the foil board. But okay. uh, this is something I'm excited to get. These, oh. these are called... I don't Nikes? remember exactly what they're called, but it's like a photo variation. It's not a photo variation. There's but nothing like on the card. <laughs> where it's everything is removed and it's just a photo. Okay. Those are pretty rare. Oh. Uh, they're not numbered or anything, but this is uh, this is awesome. This is really awesome. I'm really excited. It looks Have cool. you ever had one before? Uh, no, not so far. Huh. Is this new this yeah, year? Yeah, this is, they've, I think that they've only done it this year. They've done a lot of different variations. Yeah, you really have to pay attention. Yeah, you do. Mitch Keller, Hunter Brown, Future Stars, Nikes. Andrew Benatini, Freddie Freeman, Barslow, Jesus, <laughs> uh, Louis Camposano, Nolan Samuel, Logan Allen. All right, what do we got here? We have, okay. Uh, Taylor Rogers. Mm -hmm. Keep getting him. Foil. Matt Olson. Uh, Shout out to Bruno P. Torres in the chat Freddy. for plugging our link tree for Dude, Clutch My great. Pearls. Oh my God, thank you. That's fantastic. Okay. Uh, there. That's my new book boyfriend right now. We're, Bruno. we're gonna get through. I also can't read very well. So I'm like, <laughs> that was uh, great for a book I think podcast. Bruno, yeah, that good thing I don't read. Yep. <laughs> Gregory Santos, Arr. Brandon Nemo, and the league leaders again. It's the Yankees. Uh, Thiaro Estrada. Uh, He's flying. Yeah, there are a lot of dudes that like to uh, throw fly. <laughs> AJ Smith Shower, Elehuris Montero. Here we have a Bobby Witt Jr. blueprint. That's cool. I'm gonna have the whole set of those by this. Aaron Judge, Brandon Marsh, best beard in baseball, yeah. Christopher Morell, and then Dalton Varsho. That's a cool catch. That's a cool one. It looks like he's uh, hanging on to the J. <laughs> Let's go ahead and sleeve that just because it's funny and I'll remember that it's there. All right. Try to, I'm going to try to blaze through these. I'll probably just call out the, the hits, you know. Already you do you do what you feel, dude. Oh, there was when the Astros, uh, well, there was like, no, no, no more cheating. Probably a no hitter, but uh, no cheater. That's what we call him. <laughs> Shane Bieber. Uh, Jonathan Oviedo, Dylan Cease. Oh, here's a cool Estuary Ruiz card. Well, I like the way you said that. Say it again. Estuary, Ru Estuary Ruiz? I don't know, but the way you said it sounded really cool. Isn't that right? Yeah. I think you, I said, think, you I said, think said it Ruiz, correctly. Yeah. Ruiz, yeah. But look at the card. It's like saying, like, Lil Lily. He's, he's got little, he's got little, uh, he had mitts on, he had gloves, his little sliding gloves. Little sliders? Olsen. Yeah. I don't Jazz like him. Chisholm. I don't like him, but they're smart. He just made a mistake, and he's like, oh, I'm so Ooh, sorry. Oh, Chisholm. I fucked that up. He's jazzed. He's jazzed. Uh, that's a show. I'm jazzed, right? Uh, yeah, Amazon. it comes on Amazon after Amazon. A Thousand Pound Sisters, yeah, which Tyler we love. Yeah, Tyler Soderstrom. Awesome. Is uh, I am jazzed. Dominic uh, Canzone. I, if I, my name was Dominic Canzone, I'd change my name to Calzone. I'd Might be like, well. I'm Dominic Calzone. I'm with Morgan you. Carroll, Rookie Cup. That's nice. Is that a variation? New. No. Uh, and then Chris Taylor. Okay, moving along. These aren't. Which thing has been the most value so far, do you think? Uh, maybe that photo card we got. Uh, uh, what else do we get? I don't remember. Home run cards. Oh, you got the, the Nike card. Could be huge. The, the Nike card. Um, That's probably uh, it, huh? Well, maybe yeah. Uh, Yuri Perez, Brendan Rogers, Seth Lugo, Ronald Acuna Jr., Emmanuel uh, Clase, David Quasi. Bednar. Miguel Amaya, Clay Holmes, it's the Reds, flip it over, and we've got a foil Logan Allen card. Man, I wish nice. rookies. Paul Goldschmidt, Nathaniel Lowe, Victor Medeiros, Pete Alonso. Not a single, oh, we got that, we got a dog shit stars of the MLB, Ellie De La Cruz, but I think that's the only one we've got so far. Yeah. 
unfortunately. No Jason Dominguez at all. Nope. Christian Javier, Nolan Arenado, uh, uh, Gray Kissinger. I wonder if he's related to Henry Kissinger. Yeah. Uh, Merrill Kelly, Anthony Volpe, Elias Diaz, Jaron Duran, Sterling Mart. How do you say it? Marte, Sterling Marte, Marte. Marte. Star, Starling Marte, Starling Marte. Excuse me. Three dickheads. Byron, uh, three dickheads. Byron Buxton. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Parallels. Uh, Hope he has a year. Laddie Jr., Bobby Witt Jr. <laughs> Someone in the chat named uh, Zimmerzone asked, uh, "Is Clutch My Pearls podcast any good?" Nope. Nope. Fucking sucks. Yeah, yeah I'd skip know it. What they're doing. Uh, but you should still like and subscribe and listen and leave a review and all that stuff. And, you know, this, when we have a Patreon, like, what's up? This you know? also isn't any good, what we're doing. Uh, <laughs> but if you like right, this, yeah. But you're here. You're here. You fucking dummy. Hires, like a of Sal Freelick. Wait, uh, wait, don't just blow through the Padre. Oh, I'm sorry. Hold on. Let's go back. Miguel Waka. Michael Waka. Waka Waka. Thank you. Michael Waka. Thank you. Right. Uh, Ryan Nelson. It's the Angels. I'm sitting up. Adley what? Rutschman. Fernando I keep Tatis. moving around. Get... Ooh, look at that one. You like him. <gasps> look at that. Not... I like how all Carla of their um, Padre cards, or most of them that I've Jordan. noticed, uh, have the cool, like. The City Connect? I love them. I didn't like yeah, the City sure. Connect when it came out. And then uh, as more yet. City Connects came out, I liked it because at least it's something. Well, it's like how the, the, the Spurs will do that colorway sometimes. Yeah. yeah. And then. Uh, when they, I showed Gus a picture of the creature dressed like Batman. Oh, gosh. That, does that happen a lot? Do they do that intentionally? Is it a bit? No, it's when a bat comes into the arena. I know, but it happens enough that he's able to put his little I mean, costume I mean, I've just seen it a couple of times, you know. Yeah. I think I think maybe there's a lot of bats in San Antonio. Uh, We're going to see the creature in March. Yeah, I've heard. Oh, Jealous. Jackson. That's a cool one. That's cool. 89 throwback. Uh, Henry Davis, stars the MLB. That's nice. Sedane Raffaella, Jonathan India. I saw a Wemby. Have you seen the Wemby... Um, Billboard on I-35. No. He has his arms stretched out with H-E-B bags all along oh, them. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I can see it's... how many H-E-B bags I am. Yeah. I'm 13 ice creams. Yeah. <laughs> Miguel you got to be at least 15 ice creams to <laughs> be in the NBA. <laughs> yeah, you need to be. Uh, Matt McClain, Curtis Mead. I wonder if he... It's one of those dudes that makes his own mead because it's his name. Because it's his name? Yeah. He has to? I would do that. Yeah. Abner Uribe, Griffin Caning, uh, Joe Musgrove. There you go. Colton Kowser, Kyle Freeland. Ooh, Ronnie Mauricio. Ricky, that's cool. So uh, that, that Kyle Freeland card right there? Yeah. That's, that's the one that you got. That's yeah, the yeah, there you one. go. That's the, thank you so much. Oh. So that's what the normal you, one looks like. That's like the third time we've seen this specific card. Well, way. he's all wrapped up in here. I'll, I'll yeah, make it. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. But he's, uh, but yeah, that's like, so that's okay. what it normally looks like. Cool. That's neat. Ryan Jeffers. It's like turning the HUD off in a video yeah. game. Yeah, yeah, That's neat. Yeah. Go ahead. I don't. Heads up display. Heads up uh, display. Speaking of, your car has that, and I fucking hate it. I cannot pay attention. I just stare at it. Did you fuck with it recently? No. Uh, Did I? I Maybe. A little bit. <laughs> I think I felt where it was to see if I could put my finger over it while I was driving. I think you moved it out of place. Yeah. <laughs> when you I was drive, running, I got it, on my car today, and I was like, why is my... Why is my thing, why is my, it looks weird. It's like projected onto the, the windshield, like huh. your speed and all that shit. So it feels like you're in a video game, but I didn't like it. <laughs> so I moved it. <laughs> well, I didn't know if I, I think I was just trying to feel like. And that was bad like, for you too. I think I was trying to, I couldn't find a button for it. So I was feeling around thinking maybe if I put a piece of paper or something in front oh of it. Oh my God. But then I didn't. And then I was like, oh, I guess just I'll just live with it. Drive distracted. It tells you what the speed limit is and how fast you're going. I don't even know. It's just like down here. So I don't have to, uh. It's like, yeah. anyways. <laughs> uh, Fagin James Challenge. Because I got in my car today to drive and I thought, what is wrong? Something's uh -huh. weird. Uh -huh. And I'm like looking left and right. I can't figure out something's different. I thought, ah, you're losing your fucking mind. I guess I'm not. I guess I'm not. Mike Trout. Fagin Mike Trout. Easter. Mason Lynn, 89 throwback. Here's a Mike Trout. Stars the MLB. Uh, so those cards aren't really anything. Max then, Muncy, huh? who's your favorite baseball player? These are Jacob The stars of the MLB. Now nah, the foil ones are worth a little bit more. Mm. The base ones not. Got it. Maybe the if the, the rookies. Mass win. Mass win win. Oh yeah. I wonder if he's related to. Uh, it's not mouse. spelled the same. No. Steven. Mace Windu is what I was gonna say, but that's cool. That'd be cool if there was like a one of one on these. I can't open this. So All you right. have two. Challenges. Elites of the game. Mookie and Shohei. Look at that. Tarek yeah, Skubal. I have three at home, too. Uh, I got to sit down and do it. Rowdy Tellez, Luis, uh, Luis Matos, Tyler O'Neill, Carmen uh, Mladzinski. That just rolls off the top. Christian Walker. 
uh, Alex Bregman, Celebration of the Kid, back when his uh, infamous White Sox I days. I don't remember that at all. Yeah. Henry Davis, the very tail end of his career. This might be nice. Uh, Jordan Lawler. I think it might have been the last team he played for. Uh, Alec Marsh, Joey Votto, Zach Wheeler. When he was uh, in his like brief journeyman phase of his career. I realized why I think I like, when I think of Greg Maddox, I think of him as a Cub and uh -huh. I think of him as a Brave. Because I'm a little older than you. Uh -huh. And it's right around the time I started watching baseball. I think 86, 87 was his rookie year. Uh -huh. And he was a Cub. He yeah. played for the Cubs for yeah. six years. Yes. And so my first introduction to him was as a Cub. I get it. Uh, Andy uh, Ibanez. Are you familiar uh, with Casey and JoJo? Yeah. Jeff and I played that uh, all my life. All my song. life, yeah. Mm -hmm. Jeff had never heard it before. Mm -mm. That's insane. That song was inescapable in the 90s. Yeah. That's the song that I sing that uh, almost said his name, The Child. I don't think I turned on a radio uh -huh. from like 18 to 35. You can say the But name. the audience doesn't know. They think they know. Pfft. It doesn't come out till Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh so you're going to keep it till Wednesday. Well, I mean, don't you want them to the find out when they find out? They think they know, but they like they the real don't. world, you know. Uh, you have Raphael, no idea. Bryce Harper. You think you know. Sure. But sure. you have no idea. It's just getting real. Also, it's... How's on Kim? How's on Kim? Yeah. How does that... Uh, also, the season against the Dodgers in Korea. Do you think that your little doggy would like that toy? He would chew the ears off of it and then rip it open and then tear all the stuff out. Oh. That's why I gave one to Gracie so she can give it to Cinnamon and Cinnamon can just lay next to it. Oh, it's a cool card. Cin well, Cinnamon cut Joe Jacques. It? I think that needs to be the, in the promo photos for it's it. Cinnamon. It's a cinnamon roll. Mm. <laughs> Jose Ramirez. Why isn't Cinnamon here? This is not. Not the best photo of Tom Seaver. That's ever. awful. He's like, Why did they do that to him? <laughs> I'm Tom Seaver, guys. <laughs> uh, Juan Soto. I'm oh, that was cool. Jordan Westberg, Eduardo Rodriguez. Do you have the box for this? Once I know, he doesn't play for San Diego. No, we right? traded he him to the, the Yankees. Yankees. Yeah, Yankees. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because he was not going to sign an extension with anyone. Yeah. He's a Boris guy. Uh, bah, 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 bah. And this guy, and that guy, and this guy. Don't skip this over guy. the Padre. What are you doing? And then, uh, there you go. Thank you. Matt Waldron. You got that one in a different Lord parallel. Jesus. Bryce Fun. Elder, Joey Weimer, Marco Luciano, 89 throwback rookie, uh, Ronnie Mauricio, Tyler Sodastream again, Daniel Grant, and Trent Grisham. Yeah, he's, a, uh, he's also a New York Yankee. Is he really? Did yeah, he go with that he's trade? part of the Soto trade. What did y'all get from the Yankees? A bunch of pitchers, Michael King and a few other guys. Um, I think it's Good gonna trade. help us where we need it, and we didn't, I, I, Soto doesn't do anything for me as like a yeah. player, so it's like, you know, it's fine. I don't really care. We lo we also lost that Soto trade, so it doesn't matter. Brian Wu, Spencer Strider. That's our first Spencer Strider today. That's weird. Nick and Fortunes. and they're in the, it's in the Brave City Connect too. Yeah. Jordan Romano, uh, JT Real Muto. Do they only Phillies, wear those at home games? Will Brennan. Yeah, they only they wear them at home, but not always. It's just sometimes. Just sometimes. I think they you know, wear them like I think it's 15, 12 times a year. Well, in NBA they wear them 12 times a year. In baseball, it's like pitchers' discretion what uniform they use. Oh. A pitcher gets to choose? I think so. Grant Hartwig. Really? But aren't there multiple uh, pitchers a game? The starting pitcher. Tatis. Wow. There he is. The man what himself. other little decisions does he get to make? Uh, what pitch to throw? Well, yeah. If but he's like, picking off a guy at first. Are these sleeve or no sleeve? No sleeve. Just these two are the last sleeve. Okay. Uh, and then that's the end of the monster okay. box. Is that right? Do you think that it's like a superstitious thing where they're like, I pitch better when we wear this out little outfit? It is. That's cool. Yeah, this little outfit. The oh, Padres were on a losing streak wearing their road, I think the brown jersey. Oh, and uh -huh. so they would, like, you Darvish would pick it and the whole team would, like, fall apart. And it happened, like, three other times and they stopped wearing them, like, the rest of the year. Dang. And it's such a good jersey. So they went, they wore, like, the sand. That's, like, the classic one. What's wrong, babe? I was just thinking. So here's where we are. We got about Come five on, minutes left. I don't want to crack open another box. No, no, no. We've got, here's what we've got left. We've got the uh, mega box. Mega box. We've got a uh, retail box. Retail we've got box. the. Hobby and Hobby Jumbo. So yeah. we'll save those for next week. These are okay. going to be where the money is. What was the, oh, well. Um, what'd you say? Oh, well, you could probably blast through the Jumbo one. That's only. No, it's 20 packs. Oh, shit. We don't have like that time. But what we can do. Monopoly. Up some of these Monopoly. Oh, yeah, you Let's do, do have it. some. Five minutes left, and then Gracie can go home. We'll go. Uh, so close. Almost there. Unless you guys want to do like another hour or two. 
We got the cards for I it. just remembered I have to be anywhere else. Uh, I got to clutch my pearls with your wife. With my small wife. I'll see her for one half hour today. Okay. Cheater these. Very excited. Great parallel. You want a Wemby? Yeah, I want a Wemby okay. or any Celtics. I think it's going to be a nice. Brandon Miller, base rookie. There we go. That's good. Uh, Jalen Brown, there you go. SGA, purple wave. Ooh, nice. That's nice. So we'll sleeve those in a way, if you wouldn't mind. Oh, yeah. Thank you. All of them? Uh, actually, yeah. Say, sleeve the case all. Let me know when we I'm get I'm going to choose path. what order you go in. I like that. It's like uh, choice. Jordan nope. Hawkins, base rookie. Nick Smith, base rookie. Chet, year two card. And a okay. Kobe Bufkin, purple wave rookie. That's nice. Okay. This one has good stuff in it. So we'll sleeve that one. I think it's crazy that uh, guys that are playing in the league now are named after Kobe Bryant. Mm-hmm. Crazy. Oh, right? wow. Crazy. Not Do, nuts. Are there any named LeBron yet? No, not yet. No. There will not be. Yet. There will be. Tatum. Tatum. Base, Anthony Black, uh, Aaron Gordon, and Jimmy Butler. We'll sleeve that. Jimmy Buckets. Tatum. Yeah. These are sleeves. Is that it? It's, or there's more? No. Well, um, okay. Do this one now. Okay. Thank you. I like it. <laughs> Never heard that song. Just like, I oh, did you just make that up? Blasting it yesterday. <laughs> well, she was, anytime Le she sings is that a song. LeBron James? And I, yeah, LeBron. LeBron uh, James? Anytime she sings a song that I've never heard, I'm uh -huh. like, oh, it must have been a popular song that I missed. Ah. What was it? And I just had never heard that one. Weird. My song for Henry was uh, the uh, Diana Ross and Lionel Richie song, the Endless Love song. Nice. That's good. Mm. Sing both parts to him. Mm hmm. James Harden base, yeah. uh, Jamal Murray base, Jose or Joel Embiid base, and then good. Air uh, numbered to five hundred. Uh -huh. This is uh, Pascal Siakam gold mojo. Maybe is what what that would be called. Gold mojo probably. Uh, that's a gorgeous that. card. I mean, it's like um, I mean it's numbered, which is cool. Hmm. Not super rare. Uh, that's gonna be one? have the good one in it. This is gonna have the Wimby. Yeah. We'll open one more box before we're done. I bet. Um, I can, ah! Careful. Wimby. Wimby. My Wimby. Anthony Davis. Hey, the Sabonas. Jaime Hakez, uh base rookie. That's good. And then Triple J. Doncic. Nobody's ever heard of him. Full hand, box. Luca. Wow, more. Oh my God. Yeah, we're just gonna open real fast. We got three minutes. Blast through them like they do on the breaks that we watch. And then Gracie can go home. Finally. I'm finally going home. Do you want home. me to sleeve these? She just wants to go home. No, 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 no. She just wants to go. Guys, she just wants to go home. So all she wants to do is go home. I'm going to open them up all at once. Here, I'll help open. Oh, this comes out March 15th, I think. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's really cute. Is that, is that what, is that what they call a you can go. You can go to shouldermonkey.shop, and it takes you to store.roosterteeth.com. It was a whole thing. Don't worry about it. Shouldermonkey.com. Dot shop. shop. Dot shop. Shouldermonkey dot shop. Okay. Okay. That's a peak. Here we go. We're gonna. <laughs> uh, Paul George, Scoot Henderson, rookie base. That's nice. Scoot. Uh, Jimmy Buckets, Evan Mobley. Still waiting for you to take the next step, Evan. <laughs> Luka Doncic, Tyrese Halliburton, OG Ananobi, Anthony Davis, Purple Wave, uh, Big Cat. Spencer Didwitty, Jalen Brunson, Joel Embiid, Jordan, uh, worst contract in the NBA pool. Yeah, that's my Aiden guy. Thompson rookie. What's wrong with his contract? Uh, he just sucks. Well, he sucks. He got punched, uh, now he can't play basketball. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, Pascal Siakam, Is base. Is he doing the Draymond punch? Yeah. yeah. So he had a, okay. DeMontis Simo Sabonis, uh, Russell Westbrook, Anthony Simons, I mean, Desmond Bain, Donovan Mitchell. No, keep going. Uh, uh, Ant-Man, <laughs> Gail Bridges. <laughs> Tatum and Clay Thompson. That was a so you're shot. asking, is he the one that uh, Draymond punched? And yes, but not in what you're thinking of. Probably this was a different time. Oh, not he's yeah. the guy who Draymond punched last year uh -huh. in practice. That's and, something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, okay. So you were thinking of in practice and not the, the one, one where... in the game. Oh no, no, okay. no, no, no. Not, not <laughs> Yusuf Nurkic. No. No, the the one that he like kind of slammed against the wall, but then the team yep. was like kind of okay with it because yes. they're like, I mean, he. Well, they sucks. traded him. Yeah, they went. Mm, all right, get rid of him. 
That's fine. You and that's that. the show. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. You can sign up for first at uh, fuckfacepod.com slash first. And what that does is it supports the show directly. And you're like, but what if I what if I listen to the show? That also supports the show directly. And thank you so much. You watch our Let's Play channel. Uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, we have videos. If you just watch it on reachteeth.com or fuckfacepod.com, it's really how it works. But uh, there's so much coming every day and new things and exciting. And episode 196, the best episode of the show ever. Yeah. That's coming soon. Tomorrow, well. No. no definitely Tomorrow not. is dog reveal. Well, we're recording. Uh, yeah. we're rec no, wait, not also, tomorrow. Also, it's Wednesday. Monday, so no episode of the podcast comes out tomorrow. As we don't know what we talk about. <laughs> Some of us. We just make shit up. Some of us. Others are aware of our recording schedule and our release schedule. But and not you, us. Emily and I are. <laughs> Emily and I follow these some of us categories. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but you can check us out, fuckfacepod.com. Uh, subscribe to the podcast. Tell a friend. That's really what happens. And you're like, oh, I like these other things. I don't listen to podcasts. Listen to podcasts. That's the point of all this stuff. We're trying to get you to listen to the podcast. Listen and, to uh, Clutch My Pearls. Yeah. And Even now, and now Gracie gets to go home. And that's so exciting. Let Gracie go. Let, Let Gracie go. Let Gracie go. Let, okay, well, I did it one more time. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.